Off to the Dollar Tree, let's go. All right, guys, back home with my pickups for the today. And uh, I would say that this is a pretty cool score. I found all documentaries at the Dollar Tree. And I also ordered a bunch of documentaries online. So this bad boy is pretty packed, I would say. Let's move this to the side. See what we got. I love documentaries on anything. And we should sure get a variety, but... Anyways, we got this uh, BBC Earth uh, Hidden Kingdoms here, Blu-ray, I found at the Dollar Tree, which is pretty cool. These guys do an excellent job, and um, I want to start going after their stuff, so. Uh, next up here, we got a, another BBC Earth uh, thing here. What is this? Planet Ant here on DVD. Looks interesting. Heck yeah. Uh, next up here we got, uh, let's just say Noma, My Perfect Storm, a documentary about the world's most celebrated restaurant, which I'm sure is going to be pretty good. Uh, next up. We got Last Days of Solitary here. Um, I've seen the trailer on this and it looks excellent. So I'm glad that I found this bad boy for a dollar. The Dollar Tree. Next up, we got this uh, two DVD set here The Notorious B.I.G. Bigger Than Life. And then we got uh, two turntables and a microphone. The Life and Death of uh, Jam Master J. So two for a dollar here, which is pretty cool. Great score, I would say. Heck yeah. Now those are, let's see. Yeah, those are the ones I found at the Dollar Tree today. All of those. Now the rest of these I had ordered online. So let's see what we got. Uh, first up here we got I Am Chris Farley. This looks pretty good. I'm a huge fan of Chris Farley. Love his films. Next up we got I Am Evil Knievel. This looks pretty badass. So Definitely looking forward to checking that out. And we got I Am Heath Ledger, good actor. Um, next up here we got uh, Tupac, Resurrection, in his own words. Good stuff. Next up here we got this triple feature. Uh, for the love of Spock, Back in Time, and Ghost Heads. So three docks here. It's pretty kick-ass. And one. Uh, let's see. A place at the table here. I'm going to bet that this has something to do with our food industry and how fucked up it is. You know... Looks interesting though. Next up we got the Asset King. Uh, Devil Cultus here. It's about this kid who took a friend's life back in the early 80s. Uh, it's pretty wild. I, I highly suggest you check out the trailers on this. I heard about this story um, a while back. And it's cool they made a documentary on this. Next up here we got 
The King of Kong, a fistful of quarters. Heck yeah, man. This is pretty cool. I've seen this a few times. Certified it fresh by Rotten Tomatoes, 99, rated 99%. Good stuff. It's got Billy Mitchell in there. Yes. Oh, they kind of made him look like a bad guy, but which is kind of fucked up. But it's a good documentary. Uh, next up here we got uh, Bigger, Stronger, Faster documentary. I've seen this before. It's really good. Um, recommend you guys check it out for sure. Uh, next up here we got Mr. Untouchable, Godfather or Snitch. And let's see. Um, I believe this is about a drug lord. Uh, this is the true life story of a junkie churned multi-millionaire drug lord. Yeah. This looks really interesting. I'm looking forward to this one. Like I said, man, I love documentaries on anything. I love watching them when I have the time. So we got this three pack here, this Bigfoot Exists three pack. We got uh, American Sasquatch Hunters, Bigfoot in America. We got uh, Discovering Bigfoot and Hunting Sasquatch. Interesting. So three here. So people out searching for Bigfoot. Multi-feature documentary set loaded with uh, extra features. Over four hours of cutting edge Bigfoot research and evidence. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Good stuff. Um, next up here we got Films of Fury. Filmed by Rick Myers. So this is a documentary about, you know, martial art films, Hong Kong stuff, which I'm into big time, so, heck yeah. Next up, we got the uh, Billy Meyer story here. UFOs and prophecies from outer space. Uh, anybody that's into UFOs definitely know who uh, Billy Meyer is. He's been around for a long time. Filming UFOs, I think, since the 50s, 60s, 70s. He's got some pretty wild footage. Don't know what to make of all of it, but it is interesting to go over and look at um, and all that. But, yeah, uh, Billy Meyer is well-known in the UFO world. Uh, next up here we got... Uh, a and E. When it says biography presents who killed Tupac, Tupac Shakur, A um, and E uh, documentary here, um, which we all know who done it. Now it's Keefe D. Orlando Anderson, you know, and all that. That story has been broke after all many years, but yeah, that looks interesting. And we got one more here. Let's see, we got the DVD Blu-ray combo here of OJ, OJ Made in America, 30 for 30. This feels kind of heavy, so I'm going to guess this, uh, this is at least a four-disc set here, all that. But yeah, OJ Simpson and all that. But yeah, quite a bit of documentaries um, here today. As you can see, we're loaded up. This is going to take me a while to go through, but man, like I said, I love docs and I'll watch them on pretty much anything. It doesn't matter to me as long as it's interesting. I'm cool with it. But anyways, uh, yeah, that is it for this video, guys. Uh, I'm out of here and have a kick-ass day. Peace.